Hi, this is Haley from Cyclocane.com. Ignore this overlay that says TornadoHQ.com. I don't know what that's about. Instead, what we're going to do is talk about this storm right here. If I could zoom, thank you very much. This thing is expected to reach tropical storm status and would be tropical storm Arlene. Now you might notice it is named number two, tropical depression number two. Why is that? Let's see if we've got the right thing. No, we don't. It's right here. In mid-May, it looks like the National Hurricane Center went back and re-examined a low in mid-January and decided that it was actually should be reclassified as a subtropical storm. So that thing is technically the first. Obviously, it happened way, way out of season. But that mid-January storm, look, number one. So this is now going to be tropical depression number two. Also probably future tropical storm Arlene. In terms of the quantitative precipitation forecast, ignore the overlay, something's happening. Let me, we'll turn that down. I don't know how audible that would be. It's trying to announce a new special marine warning. So the rain expected from this is not, it, it's well aware, well aware, well away from land. Thank you very much. But in the public advisory, the National Hurricane Center does bring up that in Florida, there is some possibility for flash flooding. This is what the marginal risk for the next three days. So this one is through Friday, through Saturday, through Sunday. But that's supposed to be unrelated to Arlene, basically. But so this thing is expected to turn into a, a low, I believe, on Saturday that they've got it there. So at some point, it may well be headed for Cuba. That's right. There isn't a whole lot of specific information here. This is the, let's see, what is it? The Instituto de Meteorología de la República de Cuba. Thank you for, I can butcher all of the languages, that the next advisory on this is going to be six of the morning of the Fridays. Wait, no, Fridays is not plural. That is good. Anyway, so this thing, first, first storm of the official season, I guess. Welcome to day one of hurricane season at the Atlantic. Yay. If you'd like more information, though, you could go to cyclocane.com or the National Hurricane Center. And that is it for me today. And I hope you're staying safe out there.